If you're still up, I don't know how late, late I'm gonna go. I really was gonna wait to stream this, but I was like getting a fucking hankering to do more story, man. It's bad. I, I It was like this with Minecraft Story Mode 2, but at least there was like stopping points there, so I could do a recap if I needed to, if it had been like a week or so. But holy shit, I don't have it in me this time around. Detroit become gay. You have to already, you have to not be gay at first for that to be the title, man. Two days in a row. L listen, brother, I'm feeling it. I've been streaming, I've been having some long streams recently. That's probably a result of me having to make less videos. I just feel less strained for going longer. Like I did four hours on Wednesday, did five yesterday, and this is an extra stream. So however many hours this is, is already like on top of my usual. Quite streaming my spinterest. Is that short for special interest? Cause that's such a sick way of putting that. That's like so convenient of an acronym or abbreviation. Shortening of word, whatever it is. Spinterest is a way better word than Pinterest. It sounds cool. It sounds like something Sonic the Hedgehog would do. Five hours? Yeah, man, I was in it. 30, a good chunk of that was technical difficulties. Let's not oversell it, but... You know, we were in it. Do you think Connor is a cutie patootie? Because I do. I watched him get shot in the head. See this, you're straight. I don't know what I'm supposed to be even seeing. Also, I've started stream and realized I've not had dinner yet, bro. I might have to edit. I might have to order uh, and hope it gets here like midstream. Let, let me see what's open. Let me see what I can, where I can even get something from right now. Connor's kind of cute. He's a dope, but like in a cute way. What happened last time? We met Jericho and then it we switched. You messed up on the Hank slash Connor talk? Yeah, I've heard that it's not too uncommon to, you know, fuck that bag up, so... Also, if you guys notice anything, anything strange about the audio, I've been having issues with my mixer recently, so something seems off. It'll it'll land shortly, all right. Ooh, Chipotle's open. Go to the go to. Fuck, do I want to put guac in? Not really. I don't really want to put guac in it. Hi, quite. How are you? Not too bad. Where is the G fuel? Not here. Thanks for the sub, Jovial. Why are you so Southern? What are you talking about? Listen, I I don't know if it's like a fucking... Like, just their end, but if you're, you guys are having audio issues, like, that's why. It's, I have a faulty piece of equipment. How's the game? I'm unfortunately enjoying it. it there's some, like, fucking game jank in it, I won't lie. There's some really stupid, like... You do X thing and something that... There's no way you could have possibly anticipated it happening happens. Like, it does not clearly communicate what choices you're making, like, in a single word. Okay, Chipotle on the way. It's like 15 minutes from here, I think. Rate it 1 out of 10. I give it a 1. Detroit Become Human is cringe, also plays it. When have I ever played things for my own personal enjoyment? Do you think I would have ever played this game if I wasn't doing it on stream, fella? Opinions on the general concept of choosing your own path? I think it's novel. I think it's a novel concept, and I like it in certain games. Like, games that are basically just narratives. With very minimal actual gameplay like this, I feel like suit the format. Like, the agency comes from deciding how you interact with the characters. Whereas in most games, the agency comes from how you interact with the game systems. Um... Which is fine. Like, the, and the game systems just are more dialogue-driven and, uh choice based or like very explicit multiple choice based than um you know a god of war hack and slash that being said i i don't really prefer multiple choice games like multiple endings like here like you know if you like something you choose to do at the end gets you one ending and then you do a different thing it gets the other like star wars the force unleashed that's fine but you know some people will say replay value but honestly i like i will probably be burnt on the game by the time i do my first playthrough also, guys, no alcohol tonight, but I've got something pro pro probably more potent, less potent. I don't know. I was sipping on like 7% yesterday. This is um a, a AHC seltzer. It's weed water. It's weed water. 
so it has a delayed effect, but we'll get there. Aren't you always high? Uh, I mean, when I stand on my money, I'm, I'm high. No alcohol, you quitting? I just didn't feel like having it today. Listen, the hangover this morning, like, m kept me under the sheets way longer, and I almost missed those KSI fights. Did any of y'all watch those, by the way? Because I really fucked with them. Wait, is weed colored? Confirm. Always have been. You should so try soju with that. With chi Thai, that shit's so damn good. I don't think I need alcohol right now, man. Wait, what's your Chipotle order? I get, um... Wait, no, you could be working at Chipotle right now, and then I tell you my order, and you want to see if you get that order, and you're like, I know who he is now. I know who quite is, because you fucking got my order. KSI still fighting? He played... He fought earlier today, and he fucking slept the dude. Let me see if I can find a clip for y'all real quick before we jump into this. This is the last thing I'll do before I boot up the game. Uh, Misfits for knockouts. Because there were some good ones. There was a lot of good uh, knockouts. Dizone. Did Dizone already post them? Sometimes they do. Okay, okay, sick. They, they posted the full highlights already. Look at this. Oh, wait. Uh, look at this black screen. First, it's the tail of the tape. Taylor, 33 years old. Virgo. I didn't watch this one. I don't really care. I'm just going to find. I don't know if you guys watched the last YouTube boxing thing KSI was on, but the two people he fought in that one night were fighting on this card against their own opponents and beat both of them. Like, this dude has, like, every disadvantage against this guy. Like, height, experience, fucking weight class. Um, and, 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 like, here, he one-taps him. He one-taps him. And you see him immediately stop. It's there's like one punch. It. There's like one punch here. Look, get inside still and He's on him right above, or excuse me, right below the left oh, eye. So right there, there was it. Was it. Oh, yep, that one punch ended the whole thing. When you see a fighter, he he literally couldn't see out his left eye. All right, I'm only gonna show you the uh, KSI knockout because it's good. Peep this, peep this. He fucking folds, dude. Angles here. Give Tommy something to look at he hasn't seen. <laughs> Fucking dropped him. Dropped him. Dropped him. Holy shit. Peace hug. It's called a clinch. It's like when you are um a tall... I forgot. It's like when you're like a taller opponent, I think. Um, When the per like an opponent gets in close. um, Or a clinch basically makes it so that like no, it's hard to get good shots on any of y'all. Yeah, what, one more time. One more time. Fucking he folds. He hasn't seen. Flops like a washing board. Shout out Face Temper, though. Shout out Face Temper. Shout out Fate KSI. Um, I, you know, after that performance, it shows that he's a level above a lot of these fighters. And I'm like, okay, he needs a real challenge. But also, like, him versus Jake Paul is a lot more competitive than I was giving it credit for. Like, in my head, Jake Paul is just so far above where KSI has shown himself to be. But fuck, he is, he is putting in the work. He's proven that to me. Anyways, Detroit become human. You guys don't care about this shit. When you have a height advantage, you can do a clinch. Yeah, you can kind of like put your body weight on the person you're fighting, like lean on them. D D Steam, do not fucking open your little poo ass, little fuck ass. Wait, where is it? Quantic dream, more like quantic P. Get it? Cyberlife, the company that manufactured me, is conducting a user survey. I could not care less. Would you like to participate? Not even... Should I? Is this something I should participate, or is this just a meta way of Quantic Dream getting uh, personal info out of me? What type of path are you aiming? I'm not aiming for any. I'm just playing the game and seeing how it goes. Just do it? Great. Let's start. Would you consider having a relationship with an android that looks like a human? Yes, no, don't know. I don't know. But also, this is like some... Yeah, get a robot girlfriend, you know? To be fair, like, I, I'm fucking one that does not look like a human. The, th it, the, the looking like a human part is not the important thing. It's like it being alive. 
in having agency to make decisions. I don't know. Do you think that technology could become a threat to mankind? Yeah. If you had to live on a deserted island and could only bring one object, what would it be? A book, a cell phone, pen and paper, console, and instrument. Um, a, a console's pretty much useless. Um, because you don't have a TV. Pen and paper has limited supply, and a cell phone will only last for as long as you have the battery on. But it's also probably your best bet on getting out of there instantly, so let's go for that. Do you consider yourself dependent on technology? Of course I am. What do you look- what do I look like to you? Absolutely. What technology do you most anticipate? Flying cars, space tourism, androids... Literally none of these, dog. I don't- like, space tourism, even for like, someone nicking my kind of money, is not fucking affordable. Androids are not even in the picture right now. Brain-connected devices, fuck no. Flying cars, I guess it would solve a lot of infrastructure problems, so, Do you believe cool. in God? Uh, don't know. Would you let an android take care of your children? Uh, don't know. How much time per day would you say you spend on an electronic device? All my waking hours. More. <laughs> Too much! If you emergency surgery, would you agree to be operated on by a machine? If I saw the stats, don't know. Do you think one day machines could develop consciousness? Yes. Okay, let, let's see how I stacked up. 19% don't know on, like, the relationship. Most people agree that it could be a threat to mankind eventually. I, I, I'd like, I think the people answering this are taking it the wrong way. It's not asking if you think it will be. It's just, is it a possibility? In which case, it objectively is. Like, we get killed by our own machines already. If you had to live on a deserted island, pen and paper, cell phone? I feel like I'd break the paper, because I wouldn't have a surface to write on, and then, like, if I stab a hole in the paper, it's done for. Wait, what Saturday stream? Um, extra, it's an extra one. Do you consider yourself dependent on a technology? Fucking absolutely. If you're playing Detroit Become Human, and you say you're not dependent on technology, if you're the type of person who knows what this game exists, you're lying. Uh, flying cars. Brain-connected devices are the ones you anticipate the most? I don't want that shit in my head, man. Like, I, I, I'm not worried about any of that. I'm worried about, like, getting people to places more efficiently. What's an instrument gonna do? I mean, I guess the assumption is that you're stuck there, and an instrument is something that has technically infinite literal replay value. It's something- it's a skill you can practice while you're there. Do you believe in God? 52% no, don't know. Would you let an android take care of your children? Don't know. How much time per day would you spend? Fucking <laughs> everybody playing this game spends too damn time, too, too damn much time on electronic devices. I'd probably, I'd probably say yes on that. Okay. Continue, yeah. How long do you plan on streaming today? How until I get bored, really? Hey, look, it's this bar again. Wait, no, this is a different bar. Reconcile with Lieutenant Anderson. Are they going to discriminate against me for being a robot? Number five in the third. Lickety split. That Philly's one hell of a chaser. You want to flood it? Last shit hot tip you gave me sent me back a week's wages. Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. Me when I check if somebody's lying. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, let me fucking. There we go. Illegal gambling fraud. What what else has he got going on? Wait, no, I'm gonna stay in this fella too. No crimes. I find that hard to believe. Resisting arrest, breach of hygiene regulations. Oh, in an establishment like this, that could be a problem, yeah. Anybody else I should right click? <laughs> All right, I'm in. Damn straight. Hey, 
won't regret this. The, mo the most unrealistic part about this scene is they're listening to British music in the streets of Detroit. This is the sub Slaytron there. What you ever do is you're told. Look, you don't have to follow me around like a poodle. I get lonely. I like your beard. <sighs> Apologize. Now that we're partners, I thought it would be a good idea to get to know each other better so we can work as a team. We are not partners. I am a human. You are a machine. And I'm completely capable of Just getting the shit out of you. that buddy a bullshit program, okay? There you go. Is it poison? Hamburger. Hamburger. Holy fuck, that's a lot of calories. Drink. XL soda. <laughs> Fucking Christ, dude. Thank you for the sub, Toxic Arrow. Appreciate it. Viva, Viva, Discover card. Missing cat in Saiyans. Oh, thanks, Gary. I'm starving. Don't leave that thing here. Huh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. Don't call me a thing, dickhead. Don't you see how the rain perfectly glistens off my forehead the same way it does yours? I'm a human. Can I try? Cholesterol. Gambling. This Pedro? He was proposing illegal gambling. Am I right? Yeah. And you made a bet. Yeah. Damn. Habit? I don't want to alarm you, Lieutenant. But I think your friends are engaged in illegal activity. <laughs> He's such a fucking dope. He's such a fucking dope. I don't bother him. Fair enough. Get your bag, sis. Deviance. About Connor. Uh, let's talk to you. Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. <laughs> well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Well, they fucked up. <laughs> He's like, you fugly, bro. You ugly. Oh, uh, I feel- should I ask him about androids? I feel like- I feel like that might be, uh... I- I don't know, man. I don't know. Aww. Hi- listen, dude, I don't know how you're gonna look like that and say the dude with, like, the most sculpted fucking chin and the greatest hairline known to man or robot kind is just there. Do it? No. Don't know? Okay, let's just do Deviants then. I don't want to push his buttons. Maybe I should tell you what we know about Deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software Thanks of the 50 some bits. androids, which can lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. They start feeling shit. They don't shit. really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions. If that makes you feel which better. Which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Emotions always screw everything up. People cosplay quite the sometimes. androids aren't as different from us as we thought. Hank and androids? I have to fucking ask, apparently, huh? Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate androids so much? I have my reasons. You ever dealt with deviants before? Once or twice. Wait, wait, when I got shot. And shot a guy. A few months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with the little girl. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Know everything there is to know about me? Should I lie? Guys, do I lie? I don't know if he likes having his emotions appeased or if he just wants me to tell the truth. Truth, you know what? Be honest. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years, and you spend a lot of time in bars. So what's your conclusion? Sincere? Sincere? 
I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge. But adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. Yay! Thumbs up! We did it! Pass the skill check. I just got a report of a suspected... Pass the skill check. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in the car if you need me. Me when I'm in the car when somebody needs me? Oh, my food's almost here. He's like, eh, he's not so hey, bad. You run out of batteries or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh. Well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. That wake was for me. I'm coming. <laughs> do he's what now? Question the suspect. Hey, what do we know about this guy? Not much. Lives in a shithole, apparently. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Listen, assuming, like, it seems like money in this world has not inflated too far beyond what it is where we are now, even though it should have. If you can afford an $8,000 Android, certainly you can afford, like, a few months' rent. Nobody's supposed to be living here, but the neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh, Christ. If we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise, we're gonna need more cap. Rock Pigeon. Pigeons Oops. live here. Hey, were you really making a report back there in the elevator? Just by closing your eyes? Correct. Shit. Wish I could do that. It would be convenient. Oh, they're having a house party in there, man. I wish alcohol, I wish drunks could... Fuck. I wish uh, robots could get drunk. That is what I was trying to say in a cheeky manner. The way it cut off made it sound like cock. Funny. Anything I'm missing here? I just want to see if there's, like, any analysis I can do before I advance the plot. He is a robot. Yes. Hmm. Guys, how, who wants- how, how much y'all, like, want to- Jillian. Jillian, I, ha, I have a poll idea. A little wager idea. Uh, fucking make in uh, a poll. Or, like, make a wage if you think, like, when they think the weed drink I'm drinking will hit me. Like, um, give it, give it a time frame. Within the next hour or after the next hour? Let's find out. Because I've been sipping weed juice. I'm not exactly gunning it like you do alcohol because it doesn't... Weed drink? Yeah, it's, well, it's a hemp drink. Um, but it's got AHC in it. Forty-five minutes, forty minutes. Wait, we'll let Jillian do the do the hard do the hard part. The fuck is weed juice? It's juice that gets you high. The guy at the store said it keeps your mind clean, so I'm gonna see if I can see if I'm at all in streaming condition. Anybody home? Open up, Detroit Police. How much you have? Like a third of a can. Stay behind me. Got it. Okay. Whoop, the music got intense. Oh, one second, fellas, my food just got here. I have to take this. When the food gets here, I'm probably gonna watch a video for a bit, and then like fucking speed run a chow down, and then and then we'll get back into it. Just because it's it's already hard enough playing this with one hand. There's no way I could do it while eating. Nothing in there. Where did he go? I lost him. Read. Red ice epithet. Oh, it's just drugs. Who cares? Green Earth. Past the tipping point? Is that what the fucking planet looks like? Jeez! Are you playing with one hand? Well, I, I, I usually, like, just play with mouse and during cutscenes. 
and then in like my left hand is off the keyboard to like take a swig of water. Or whatever. Pigeon! What the fuck is this? Those are pigeons. Ugh. Jesus, this place stinks. Well, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's gone. Not quite. Just the fact streamers are finally giving this name recognition after five years later. Dude, what are you talking about? I hear this game talked about all the time. It's the only reason I'm playing it. It's another, it's, it's like an unexpected pick, but it's one of them like Tumblr fandom ass games where you like love the characters so much you make fan edits of them and ship them in gay ways. An unlikely, an unlikely culprit. This is like Morbius saying it's Morbin time, essentially. Clues to analyze. When the game came out, everyone hated it. I was there, I remember. Oh yeah, I'm, I have my problems with it, but I'm enjoying it over, overall. Book. It is a Bible. The King James Bible. <sighs> I need some fresh air. There's no fresh air in Detroit, buddy. Found something? I don't know. It looks like a notebook, but it's indecipherable. Oh, food's here. Food's here. While we eat, guys, can I show you some music from a few albums I've been listening to recently that have just fucking blown me away? Like, there, there's some music I've been listening to that uh, I absolutely adore. Yes, food. Man. There was, like, one other one. I'll just put on another Jake Hall song. Um... Quite stop the music. I'm eating, bro. I can't play the game while I'm eating. I'm a little, little good thing. Slightly love a little more meat. Good, fellas. I'm almost done. I'm, I'm over halfway done. Thing. I've been fucking shoving it down my throat. Those of y'all calling them ugly in the chat? Yeah. You're just some fucking names on the screen. Y'all pussies. We came a long way, man. We just came a long way. Sitting on top of this shit. This shit can go one or two ways. This shit can go up. It can go down. Banger album cover, real. Either way, nigga, I'm prepared. Feel me? Yeah. I be coming in peace, but fuck me. Best beware the others. This shit deep on the covers creep. This southern heat make them bearable. Summer just last week, seen your mama weep. Crying cause she don't wanna bury your brother. The blood leaks while the EMTs gotta carry her baby like surrogate mothers. Whoa, thank God we survived around with a terrorist. Hover though traumatized, wouldn't trade it for nothing through hard times. It was there I discovered a hustle and making the best out of struggle. I kept grinding to the step, but level respect mine. Gotta stay out of trouble cause tech nines like the air rebuttals. Cold world niggas knowing what it is. Just in case they don't, I show them what it is. In summer, I do real numbers. Couldn't dead touch it if they sold a double disc. Black cop niggas burning up the street. Shots popping and we heard it up the street. It's a war, niggas running up the score. Jesus said that you should turn the other cheek. Once this niggas getting murdered every week, dead bodies smell the older industry. My homie, homie got out on parole. He's on my Coca Cola than the soda industry. Summertime, bring the coldest when the breeze. Hella blues like the rolling 60s. Christ went to heaven, age 33, and so did Pipsy and so did Nipsey. I told you, I told you, this shit can go up, it can go down, I don't give a fuck, nigga, I done seen the highest heights. For those asking, this was a J. Cole interlude in the album this is off of. It's all shit like this, it's so good. It's like soul sample beats and just fucking him spitting, I love it. Anyways, back to the matter at hand now that I got fucking food in my stomach. Move, pigeon. Do they fly out of here, or do they just, like, go somewhere else in the room? Oh, 
way, I gotta turn this up again. What are you eating? Chipotle. Pigeon! Sorry, I see I see one and I get excited. Was this guy doing drugs? Suspect does not eat. <laughs> He just feeds pigeons. Suspect cares for wild animals. He seems like a pretty stand-up guy. He's not like le le leeching resources anywhere. He's taking care of the local community. He's not bothering anyone. Jesus, I hate these things. Military jacket, secondhand initials. R T. Probably initial. You missing anything? Put his initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. Oh, wow, what a convenient ID. Oh, it's fake. Authenticity for driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. It has a face Real on it. Books. I thought I was the last guy to try to keep some. Any idea what it means? RA-9. Written 2,471 times. It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Why are they obsessed with this sign? I saw four, not an A. Looks like mazes or something. Huh. Obsessive compulsive writing. It's literally just the name of fucking George R.R. Martin's work process. Sample. Mmm, tasty. Blue blood? Okay, yep, definitely Android. Can you get, like, robot AIDS if you consume uh, another Mercy. robot's blood? Ooh, it's the little ring in his head. It's LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. Um, uh, speak for yourself, buddy. Another throne chair. Recently disturbed traces of avian fecal matter. That's a big word for poop. There's one. Where's the second? Where is number two? There it is. Opened marker pen. Suspect was here recently. Avian fecal matter, aka bird poop. Used to know a guy that raised pigeons on a raised pigeons on a roof. Wasn't that like an NPC in Spider-Man? Did you steal that from the game? Oh. He tripped. Suspect ran to the living room. My detective vision. Fingerprint. More, more bird shit. Skid mark. Also who related Is that thing alive? Oh no, it's a piece of metal. That's what we got going on here. Suspect ran towards entrance. Suspect heard us enter. Suspect is still here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Expose suspect. Time to be a narc, fellas. 
What is it with robots and, and addicts, man? Ah. Ouch. Goddamn fucking pigeons! What are you waiting for? Chase it! Why do I gotta do everything, man? This is exact- this is more intensive than Assassin's Creed Parkour, man. Like, on a technical level, you have to do more shit here. Fast, but risky. Easy, but slow. I gotta go. Safer detour. Let's go fast! What? I, I literally pressed the button! I literally pressed the button! Direct, but crowded. He's gonna take some time to go through there anyways. Wait, where'd he go? Why'd none of y'all stop his ass? We gotta go fast. Let's go, baby, let's go! The illusion of choice. Fuck! I, I fudged it, I fudged it. How do you do that? Let's go. State cardio is just not an issue for folks like us. AKA not technically folks. Direct but crowded. I got I think I can get the jump on him. Let's go. Fuck! Thanks for doing it for me, game. I appreciate the help. Stop right there. How the fuck did he get here first? I'm gonna help, I'm gonna help the fella. F uh, fuck with that software oh, instability. Shit. Oh shit! We had it. Fuck. It's my fault. I should have been faster. You'd have caught it if it weren't for me. Friend. That's all right. We know what it looks like. We'll find it. I, I got my boy Hank, and the robot did nothing wrong. All right, he he gets to chill. Hey, Connor. Nothing. <laughs> He'll come around. He'll come around. We just gotta butter him up. Achievement unlocked. Save Hank. Rupert got away. How, how, how do we know his name's... R oh, RT, right. Like RT Game, the YouTuber. Thanks for the sub, Rockhead. Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. Trail, Jericho. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Many tried to reach Jericho. Few succeed. Humans have Thanks for the sub, sub, Just Jackerton. Free? And hiding just to stay alive. That's freedom to you. That's not what Humans I said. Hate us. Hiding is the only way we can survive. There is no safe place for those like us. If humans knew we were here, they'd kill us. Jericho. This is Jericho? 
It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. Have you all seen Sumo yet? I don't feel, know what that is. But we have more freedom here than you ever did. Lost, sombered. Maybe I was never really free. Maybe I was only what my master wanted me to be. And now, I need to decide who I really am. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. Oh, the dog, Sumo? All we can do now is deal with it. You're safe here. You can stay with us as long as you want. Hey, thanks, fella. They're all so pretty. Go and see Lucy. I mean, yeah, they're made flawless, she might be able to help you. I don't know why they'd willingly leave the little circle thing in if they, you can that easily just pry it out. Yo, North kinda... She seems alright. She seems like a stand-up individual. Let's explore. Also, oh, is that guy dead? Start fire. Cause God, I cannot see shit. Hey fella, what's uh, going on with you? Not much, it doesn't seem like. It, how did I walk? Dude, I'm stuck. Dude, you're fucking kidding, I'm stuck. I'm stuck, it doesn't let me walk any further than this. Are you fucking serious? Holy shit. You are kid. I do I have to- Did I get- Did I get softlocked, man? Thank you for the thousand bits. How did this get in the game? Um, do, is there like a way to go back to last checkpoint or do I have to- is there like a last checkpoint or do I have to restart the game? Well, no choice, huh? L for locked in place. What if you switch to controller? Um, I would have stick drift. Who are you? I am Nice. Who are you? Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. The illusion of no. choice. Um, Jerick, uh... This is Jericho? Yeah, I'm skipping all the extra shit, it's man. It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. Just farted. And you knew that only an android could follow the trail, didn't you? Only those who are like us can find Jericho. If you could decide the signs, red pill. one of us trusted you enough to give you the key. There's a place where we can be free. Find Jericho. I understand how you feel. But we have more freedom here than you ever did. Okay, I'm gonna go somber Maybe again. I was never really free. Maybe I was only what my master wanted me to be. And now, I need to decide who I really am. You're lost. Yeah, thanks, bud. Just you like told the, the last time. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. I swear you're the only streamer I've ever seen struggle here. with technical difficulties in this game so much. It's, pro it's probably in part because it's the PC port, um, but I don't have an up-to-date capture card, and also it's just way more inconvenient to use a capture card than fucking deal with whatever technical hiccups I could by just playing the game on PC. You can stay with us as long as you want. Thanks, buddy. Why would we make robots with free will? Go and see Lucy. See, the, the thing she is, the people who done. made them didn't think they had free will, but then they developed emotions and sentience and stuff. Okay, so the guy is supposed to be in that corner awkwardly. I wasn't just imagining that. When was this game made again? I think like 2016, 17? I was in high school when it came out. Hey fella, you trying to chat? Dude, you look fucking awful. Like, no offense, but you look busted. 
not in very good shape, am I? My diagnostic program isn't working. <laughs> I don't think it would have anything good to say anyway. What happened to you? Got put in an oven. They tied me to the back of a car. Bruh! Dude, 420! He's 420 me. number! I don't want to shut down. No, I don't want to shut down. I'm sure we could find some robots to rob of pieces out there, man. I'm sure we could get you something. Or we could rob a factory before they get put in people. That's, that's probably the more ethical decision. Where are my optional interactions? Oh, it's all just busted up looking robots. They should decide who's the most valuable, almost about to die robot and give all their functioning parts of them. Are afraid of dying too. Do you know what happens after death? Decomposition for fellows no. like us, but robots? Rusting? No, I don't. I guess? How biodegradable are your components? Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. I was glad to meet you, Marcus. She sounds like Circus Baby? Kinda, yeah. Dude, that is such a fucking haunting way to just go out. Like humans, it's messy. It's like you like they become like if you shoot them, they like spew blood and it's all gory. When these dudes pass of natural causes, they're just frozen in the place they were left last, last. That's nuts. Because that's so interesting as a concept, man. It freaks me out. But like in a in like the wow, how creative kind of way, you know what I mean? Ra 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 ra! Oh my! Sorry, Lady Gaga. This dude stands like he has. He went to Cotillion. What's in here? Guns, I hope. Crate already emptied. Oh, it's spare parts. I thought that said Uber Life. Cyberlife Warehouse and Docks, West Torrance Avenue, Detroit, Michigan. Calculating route. Explore Jericho. I want to. I want to do more shit. I have more optional interactions. I'm trying to go through. I like her shoes. Hello, North. Damn, that's like... Time here? How long have you been here? Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. You can get more specific when than I that. escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. Ow. Jericho. What was your function before coming here? Is that like taboo to ask? What do you care? Fuck! Me when I try to get to know new people. A lot of these guys in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. They'll never accept what we are. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. I mean, I was never gonna get it, bro. I got shot in the head last time I checked. This is a definite improvement from, um, death? It's certainly squalor. But at least it's like I'm living in squalor like this. But at least the fellas live it. Why is she so fine? She was constructed to look like that intentionally. Hello, Mrs. C. How are you? Oh, she's a Are fucking hive mind. 
That looks crazy, dude. Holy shit. Sit down. That that robot design is freaky, but like in a cool way. That's so sick. And she's like tethered to this place, it looks like. Show me. What am I doing here? Oh, a wound. I'll stop the bleeding. It's a good thing we can't feel pain. Just chilling. Just hanging. Drink this. Is that blue blood? Trinium was it? Or thorium? No, no, no. It was like some fake uh, element, right? Hold E to drink. Good job! S rank! I didn't even realize she had, like, the moving textures on her skin. It's like polyatomic camo. Or Orion camo. Get up. Give me your hand. I'm not gonna say no. She seems incredibly all-powerful and like she could kill me at any given moment. <laughs> Venom. Symbiote. You had it all. And you lost it all. As it happens. You've seen hell and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Okay, listen. Which will prevail. Bro, you can't just go up to biracial people and say that. That's fucked up. Your choices will shape our destiny. Somebody did that to me once. Half light, half dark. What the- what do you mean by that? I'm the biggest bird, I'm the biggest bird. I'm the biggest bird, I'm the biggest bird. Propose a plan to S Simone Simon. That's his name. I got it right eventually. I'd show her the world. This is the world as far as she's concerned, as like far I'm aware. Thanks for the sub, local oof. Okay, I gotta light this fire for no reason. I just kind of feel like it. I woke up in a new Bugatti. Ooh, more characters to talk to. Is this... Oh my god. That's a kid. They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. Fucking Christ. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They don't, bro. They die. They won't. We're slowly dying out. Hey, listen, you guys need to get... I'm just saying, like, there is absolutely an underground market where, like, if robots were, like, willing to get together with local gang elements or, like, criminal elements, they could definitely work out some shit. It's like, listen, you are physically capable and have free will. You do this job for us, we'll get you some material so you don't die and, like, stack that paper, get in the drug trade, you know, the good shit. Everybody, it's like they said, you gotta do what you gotta do to get by. Simon. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyber Life Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. Not we if I kill the guards. We can't there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. Da we'll download that shit, bro. We need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Neutral, let's go. Maybe it's worth a try. 
Yeah! Yeah! Skill, uh, charisma check! Okay. I'm in. I can't decide whether you should live or die. All right, fellas, I gotta pay real quick. Then I'll be back to, um, becoming human in Detroit. Notoriously difficult achievement. I'm a big bird. I'm a big bird. I'm a big bird. Big Smoke. Hi. Okay, fellas, back to uh, back into action. Alice, warm. Motherfucker's in the rain again. How could she be? You gonna be okay? Get some help here. We can't see it. Oops. Just a bad memory. We can't see it. Yeah, yeah. Quit your blabbering. I fixed it. I fixed it. This is the place. Y'all are still complaining about the screen. We're there already. Holy fuck. Get better internet and you'd be able to see it faster. This is your fault at this point. Get your Wi-Fi connection up, bro. I love this part. Every people have said that about every part up till now, so. Stream delay? Stream delay would be lower if your internet wasn't like poor person internet. <laughs> get your bands up and get your download speed up. Hmm, I really had to scan to look for the doorbell. I'm a moron. What if I do it enough times? Are you Zlatko? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Small child. Come in. It's Harriet Tubman for robots. Is it? Is that? Is that who this guy is? Because I, I, listen, I'm imagining there's going to be a underground railroad on the nose allegory here in a moment. Come on in. Don't be shy. I'm feeling a tad shy now that you said don't be shy. Luther. Would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of a big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. A uh, free will, or...? Am I still wearing the Cyberlife shit under it? I guess not. Please. Make yourselves at home. Shout out, Luther. Big fella. 
How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. Is she wearing is she wearing designer, bro? How'd you find that in like the Deviant, huh? broke ass house you were in? What about her? She's human. And you want to find a safe place. Somewhere you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Good robot, good robot Beautiful rights. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Ooh! Big stuff. Great place for a fresh start. Dude, it's legit, dude, it's legit. Yes, that's that's exactly what we want. That's the fun. It, that's literally like crossing from the south to the north. Holy shit! It's so it's so on the nose. It's so on the nose. Of course. Well, I can help you, but first we have to get rid of your tracker. Tracker? Yeah. All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. Come on. He's Follow a me. lying liar. He's a lying liar. Fucking, if they had trackers, then they could find them anytime, anywhere. No, she always stays with me. Of course. And Luther has not said anything. Right, this, this is way? just his, his way of Everything fucking reprogramming. I don't trust this motherfucker. Oh, yeah, going to the basement. That's going to end real fucking well for me, huh? I'm, a, I'm just going to follow Zlatko. How about you follow these nuts in your mouth? There's gonna be an Isaac Asimov book on here. I fucking knew it! Look! It said. Wait, does it? Do any of these books say Isaac Asimov on them? I'd have to turn this to 4K to be able to tell. I knew there. I, th I was sure there was gonna be like a robot reference or some shit. Hey, look, it's me, Nero from Devil May Cry. I do not I don't like this place and that man. <laughs> Let's go. I have a bad feeling. I know. I don't trust him either. We have to be careful. Do I have to follow Zlatko? Is it required? Like, what if I just, like, left right now? Come on, kid. Let's get out of here. Buddy? Oh, fuck. I mean, nice ass, but please move. Oh. I just had to go slightly to the right. Or, um... I can't- I can't leave, huh? This is just like Resident Evil 4. The fourth one. Well, looks like we have no choice but to make some bad decisions. Making it not really a choice at all, huh? Please excuse the mess. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. That's good. Come on, Alice. What's in there? What's in there? This way, please. Glad I did that. That seems like it could be important in some time. I also don't... Listen, I got nothing against Luther, but he is... Looming over us very menacingly. Checked on Alice. Listen, I prefer to be thorough. If you could just stand over there. I'm not standing on that fucking thing. I'm not getting on it. Do I look stupid? I mean, I know I look stupid, like, I look very silly, but I am not a fool. Fellow, what's going on here? What if I... You just... <laughs> it just has the vodka on the expensive machinery. Enters Latko's machine. Well. Only way to move the plot. 
I'm a clown, not a fool. That's a good way of putting that. I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. I still do not trust him. I do not trust him. I just got my super cool hair and fit, too. You know what's strange? For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviants. That's why it's so hard to find them. So, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? You said that... Yeah, uh, people believe what they want. I, t I fucking knew it. You Deviants are so naive. They all come to me expecting me to help them. Little girl, run, little girl. And I just reset them, sell them on. Or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No! I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the. I forgot you had a small child! child. She's gonna die. I'm gonna kill her. Uh, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. That's that's so sweet. Shut the fuck up, big Ed. Sick of so you. So deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Reset. No, 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 no. There's got to be something here. There has to be a way out. what you get for having a dream it always ends up the same way tears and disillusionment he looks like he ha should have a russian accent i mean he is russian his last name's literally zlatko you're better off being erased and feeling nothing is that what you think buddy no more pain no more hopes dashed luther help a buddy out you know Almost envy you. help a fella out <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Oh, looks like Mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like Mommy's completely forgotten you. Carl, <laughs> what happened to you? Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. <laughs> oh, oh no, dude! Brittany. She is so fucking traumatized, dude. This poor kid. I'm gonna teach you some manners, you little bitch. Carl, wake up, Carl! Fella. Fella. Meet me in the living room. What? Fuck. Find a way to escape. <laughs> Lol. Skill issue. If I kick shit, if I kick enough shit, eventually, there's a correct configuration out of this, I know it. Cause a short circuit? Fuck, I'm running out of time, I'm running out of time. Fuck! Fuck! Up left, up left. Fuck! Fuck! Okay. I literally did it right! What do you mean? I literally did it correctly! Are you fucking kidding me?! This game fucking sucks, dude. I, I fucking I <laughs> look up. Holy shit! Don't worry, I fucked this up too. Am I screwed? Go back? Nah, man. I, I said I wasn't gonna go back on my first playthrough. That's like start over, please. Nah, that's not fucking. 
I, I, I'm going to do that. Help us. What did you do? This game fucking sucks, dude. I hate it. Memory. No. This can be happening. Thanks for the hundred bits, Silver Spire. You have to remember. For her sake. He likes to play with us. Creating monsters. For his amusement. But who's the real monster? Look what he did to us. I'm not gonna lie, the monster design's pretty cool with what he did to y'all. Like, it's fucked up that he that he, he did you like that, but... You must remember who you are. Otherwise, the little one will die. Alice! Memory, member, mem, mem. Meet Luther. Serves Latko. Meet Luther in the living room. I'm gonna double check if there's anything I missed back here. Maybe there could be a potential, uh. Interactable. Okay, we, we're, we, we're keeping it in motion. We're not. We have not. Screwed the pooch all the way through yet. Hey, fella. Can I just, like, walk in here? Oh, come on! I just wanted to take a look. They seem friendly. Anything in here? Thanks for the 100 bits. Hey, dude. It looks like Joaquin Phoenix. Sorry, I forgot everything. I'm remembering how to walk upstairs again. That's me! Or used to be. It's, I thought it said fart. <laughs> I thought it said fart. Isaac Asimov in here. History of painting. What a nerd. Make yourselves at home. Fart. It's literally locked. Have you tried unlocking it? That would have been like my go-to personally. Like that would have been my first attempt. Or anything to go do upstairs, or is it gonna invisible wall me again? Don't know wall. Egoed. Hey fat ass. Hey, not so fat ass. Are they a robot? Yes, this person is a robot. <laughs> Luther is over there. What's there to do over here? No, 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 I've got shit to do. Remain with your owner? Cringe. You know, the the, high, the very polygon, like, uh, doorknobs next to the incredibly detailed facial model is a little jarring. Ignores objective, pokes around the environment. 
Well, there was like a lot of optional objectives that seemed pretty important for remembering who I am. So I'm trying to make sure I don't miss those. Because I'm imagine I think those like probably add up. I've never played this game before, so um Also, this is just kinda how I play games. I fucking walk around and explore shit. It's fun. Master's dinner's ready. Take it up to him. Yes, Luther. Big guy. Big guy, whip guy. I'm going to stab you with this plate. Is there anything here that's mine that we left? Nobody quite. Ooh, other things. I mean, they're things put there specifically to be looked for, you know? It's not like... Fuck, what is it? It's not like... They included these minor details to not be observed. And you want to find a safe place? Somewhere you can start a new life. My name's Car my name is What? My name is What? My name is Is there any more? Any other uh cherished memories? Do you like Luther? He seems like a big, strong guy, but he's not exactly been on my side up till now. So that hasn't exactly been up to him. Jesse! <laughs> what if I take the food down to the, the robot slaves? Bring meal upstairs? God. This is what it's like working on a cruise ship, dude. Are you absolutely sure I can't just leave the food on the ostrich? Why are there so many? Because you're meant to look around. The entire thing of this game is like exploration and dialogue. There's not a whole lot of actual gameplay to speak of. Not, not in like the traditional sense, at least. Can I look out the shiny mosaic window? Which way is it? Bring the food to Zlatko? I, how about I bring that fucking nine I had on me earlier? Uh, just... Set it down on the table over there. This one? Not that one. What do you call a table, buddy? Got a pretty loose definition of table. And he pointed in the exact opposite direction of where he wanted it. Wait, 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 wait. Who the fuck is this? And where is Alice? He gave this dude an arm for a penis. <laughs> or an arm for a leg. Not as exciting. There's so much environment detail, I fuck with it. Now get rid of that carcass. Uh, take it next door. Please fuck off, I word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking accountant! <laughs> Did you hear what I said? Yes, Lanko. Huh. It's that asshole? No, different guy. You, we killed- Luther! Him. We killed the first guy. Luther! Yes, Lanko. I should be done here in ten minutes or so. I'll have a look at the little one and see what I can do with it. Understood, Slack. Go. I'll bring you the little one in ten minutes. Ten minutes remaining? Okay, fuck. We gotta push it. We gotta bring the carcass next door. Okay, we gotta get this shit moving. Oh, 
Oh, one of them's moving. Hey, fella. Okay, putting this down so I got hands free. Serves Letko. Who is the little girl? Remember! Read! Read! Is there shit in here I'm meant to be doing? It feels like it. Me when I do drugs. Me when I do drugs. Me when I do drugs. My name is Kara. I gotta find her. What are you doing here? Has the master authorized you to be here? You must always obey the master. Oh yes, you must always obey. You should not be here. You have no business here. No. Fuck, I went in a circle. I went in a circle. Fuck. Did I? Why it's been an hour? How are you feeling? Um, nothing yet. Two storage. Oh, he's asleep. I. I'm sorry. About the little one. Tell me where she is, big guy. Tell me where she is. Open doors a little faster, yeah? Read. I'm just- I want to save it so I can read later. These fucking, like, transition cutscenes take up so much of the fucking space, dude. Okay, 7 minutes 30. We gotta move faster than this. What happened to her? Fire. That- what was the point of that? Why was that an interaction? Save the damn girl. I'm looking, dipshit! I'm looking! Detroit residents were disturbed by a surprising chase through the city streets this morning. According- The public opinion goes down just because I turned on TV. Incredible. Founder. Alice. Car. Car, you remember me. How could I forget you? I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come here. We have to go. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? All right. On my solid snake ship. Luther! Yes, Lock. I'm finished here. Go fetch the little one. Right away, Zach. In here, in here, let's go. Hi, good. What's a safe place to hide? All of those are fucking obvious as shit. Not go! What? The little one is gone! Well, I can't have just disappeared. Gotta be here somewhere. What are you waiting for? Go look! Shit. Where are they? Luther! Find them for fuck's sake! Why are the transitions so fucking slow? This is so annoying. There you are. Catch them, Luther. Come 
I'm literally- Oh my fucking god. The lag is really cool. There's no point in running. You can't escape from me. Get fucked! Get fucked, dummy! Idiot! Stupid! Fuck! Damn it. Got him. Take the other side. Get a move on. They're over there. Front door. Oh fuck! I forgot! I forgot it's locked. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Thanks for walking, though, fella. I appreciate it. Alice! Get on me, got them back. Go, Alice! No! I won't leave! Go! Run as fast as you can! You both could have started running by now, dipshit! You both could have! I warned you. Dreams always end in tears. You should have listened to me. What are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. I don't know why he would get closer. How dare you. <laughs> Call of Duty zombies. What are you doing? Who let you out? Get away from me. Get away from me. Obey me. I'm your master. I'm your master. Get up. Fight back. Get up. Fight back. Oh, Luther controls them. Oh shit! I didn't want to hurt you. He programmed me to obey him. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like opening my eyes for the first time. Finally, I could see. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. I could take you there. I could protect you. You and the little one. All right. I trust you. Kara kind of looking like Gerard Way. I was so scared of losing. WTF found family moment. Live, laugh, love, Luther. <laughs> Holy shit, dude, that gave me a fucking headache, all the ways that could have gone. I, I want to look through this. So, I guess these two are just, like, ends where we die, right? And then, like, there's a bunch of, like, different... Okay, so there was only one hiding option I could have gone to, to not get caught. Kara reaches the stairs, Kara and Alice. Enter main room. Search house for Alice. Check fireplace embers. Is this like a separate ending? Uh, recall discussion was like, I dropped the android torso. Kara is, Kara is being reset. And then this is the alternate path. You, oh, if you, if you fix it right, you just, you just get the skip here. <laughs> and then, and then the chase scene. Okay. Okay. Fair enough.
Was there a fourth character? I feel like I'm forgetting a fourth. Okay, the hell does a robot need a, like, a, a virtual umbrella and a virtual garden for? For virtual rain. Heavy rain, you might even say. That's one for my David Cage enthusiast out there. Okay, that is the only interactable instance in for Miles. Because he wants to look snazzy? Listen, Connor did not have a problem with looking snazzy. Yo, that's the name of the game? In real. Find Amanda? Found him. Connor! The fuck are you doing? Connor, Kara, and Marcus? Okay, cool. Hello, Amanda. Connor, I've been expecting you. Neutral. Would you mind a little walk? I take it I don't have a choice. That deviant seemed to be an intriguing case. Pity you didn't manage to capture it. I don't care about this bitch's opinion. I agree. I may not be suited for this investigation. Maybe you should consider replacing me. Okay, that is not what pragmatic means, dick shit. Did you manage to learn anything? Signs on wall, diary, birds. It was fascinated by birds. We've seen deviants interested in other life forms, like insects or pets. But nothing like this. What else? Is it? Yeah, you know, I gotta tell them everything. Oh, I got. I got a snitch. Oh, that's so lame. The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. You came very close to capturing that deviant. How is your relationship with the Lieutenant developing? Pa Connor's death saving Hank. He seems to find it difficult when a Connor is destroyed and replaced. I know humans have difficulty dealing with loss. Working with him will be a challenge if it happens again. I simply will stay alive forever. We don't have much time. Deviancy continues to spread. It's only a matter of time before the media finds out about it. We need to stop this. Whatever it takes. I will solve this investigation, Amanda. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Find Anderson and investigate it. Did Ralph die? No, I think he just got left in there. Actually, Connor might have killed him. I don't remember. I don't really care if he dies. Ralph was not a good fella, all right? He, listen, he was, he is a part of an oppressed and horrendously mistreated class. But he was still gonna kill both of us, so like, we're just, you take your losses, count your losses. Okay, fellas, it's hitting. I want to say, whoever guessed that my shit would start hitting in after about an hour, starting to feel it. It's creeping in. It's creeping in. I don't know how strong it's going to get, but... Oh, it's it's certainly there. It's certainly there now. Me when I go to your fucking house. Can you imagine if your boss came to your house and it's like, Hey, hey, let's do it. Let's work. I love my job. I love my job. What's hitting in? I was eating... I was drinking weed water. Lieutenant Anderson! Ding dong. Ding dong. Anybody home? Find a way inside. <laughs> oh, that's so annoying of him. His car's here, so he didn't crash while driving drunk. That's something. 
Nothing. 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 Okay, that, that you can Q interact with that, but it seems like you can do a... You're gonna break in or something, or a side door. Or just find an extra key. There's a few options. Doggy! Doggy! Look at it, doggy! What was he watching? Dog, St. Bernard, big fella. Oh, he's fucking dead. Oh, he's unconscious. Thanks for the 55 bits, spaghetti. Okay, this is a little dramatic. That was dramatic. Easy, sumo. I'm your friend. <laughs> See? I know your name. I'm here to save your owner. You don't smell like anything. Oh, I gotta feed the dog. I gotta feed the dog first. Check on Hank. No, I gotta feed the dog first. I gotta feed the dog first. Sorry. There's no food in his food bowl. Oh, he just has the bag in it. Ah! Come on, man! You know you can talk to me about this kind of thing, right? I might be a robot. I have built-in therapy courses. Firebar data. Oh, he was play. He was playing Russian roulette. He was. Oh fuck. That's great, buddy. No signs of trauma. Slight arrhythmia. He's breathing. Forty percent alcohol content. Scotch whiskey. Ethylene Lieutenant. coma to suspected. Lieutenant! Hello! Wakey wakey! Wake up, Lieutenant! Ah! It's me! Come! <laughs> I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey! You have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. I need you alive, unfortunately. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. <laughs> Shut up! Attack! Good job. <laughs> Attack! <laughs> fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. That's why I bring you to the bathroom. Do it in the toilet. Or a trash can if you can't make it, but not on the rugs. Not I'll on leave the rugs. Me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. Come on, buddy. You may have well red like highly textured hands, what but What are you doing? <sighs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is like a torture scene, practically. What the fuck are you doing here? A homicide was reported 43 minutes ago. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were at home. Jesus, I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. Far from it, buddy. Can't you just leave me alone? Solution pragmatic? You seem to have personal issues. You should consult a professional who can help you. Beat it, you hear me? Get the <laughs> hell out of here! Stop it. Get some help. I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. Teehee. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. <laughs> I'll go get them. Is he even gonna be useful at all in the fucking, like, investigation? He's gonna be falling over the whole time. He- <laughs>
Oh, I thought this dude was on an air mattress. Never mind. This seems pretty homey. Like, this is a fucking huge closet. What the hell? What do you- like, what should you- Oh, he has a wife. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Stripey, hippie, streaky. Hmm, hippie, stripey. What makes him look the most sober? Why the fuck was someone killed in a sex club? Android, probably. You know, you know shootings ha happen outside of strip clubs all the time, right? Hippie, streaky. I'm feeling stripey, man. It's the it, it looks the best in my opinion. I like streaky. Does he need pants too, or? Scanning for cum stains. Turning on my black light vision. Oh my god, he masturbates in this bed several times a day. You'll be alright, buddy. You'll be alright. Are you alright, Lieutenant? <laughs> Do I look good? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wonderful. Just, uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. Quiet, go back. <laughs> That's my leaky butthole. Learn more about Hank. I want to watch the news. Many experts are suggesting the specter of a third world war draws closer every day. This was definitely before they invaded Ukraine and got the shit slapped out of them. Ooh, cosmic horror book. Time to pull the plug. Screening for depression. A recent study led by Guy has linked the amount of time we spend on screens to depression. With the widespread antidepressant epidemic. Surrounded by screen-based devices, but it can have other harmful consequences. with bad sleep. Yeah, I, we already know all this, dude. This is not new. This is not like a fucking breaking news type shit. Tainted love. Police to use marketing data to identify criminals early. Guilty until proven innocent. Are American senators really correct? No shit! This isn't even like an interesting in-world examination. This is just stuff happening right now to a much more egregious degree than in this apparently dystopian game. Like, holy shit. Like, what? Senators get lobbying money? No way! You're kidding! The dinner table? Nice piece, huh? Hank has suicidal tendencies. You, you, you noticed? Didn't know if you could tell. Aww. Aww. Hank lost his son. To an android? Doggy. Be good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. I'm driving. Sumo, Sumo. Russian roulette, literally. Find picture of Hank's son. Read, pull the plug. Read, tainted love. I did all the pointless objectives instead of finding out more about Hank. Now he's sad because you couldn't pet him? I didn't know you could. Also, I don't know, I might have lied about it hitting it. I thought it would show up by now. I'm not gonna have more because that'd be like dumb and fuck me up, but... Did we not have, like, winter clothes? This is crazy. 
If they catch us, we're dead. We're dead if they don't catch what us. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. Damn, I'm slow as hell. That was convenient. Don't let them see us. Watch out. Damn, they make androids that don't look like androids? I'll find another way. Okay, let's get it. Which one is your favorite storyline? I'm like most it's I'm more per, I'm the most personally attached to um Kara and Alice's, but Connor's is like the most implication wise or like world building, just kind of like concept. It, it, like it, it intrigues me the most. I think this dude's is going somewhere, but it, um, it's ramp. This one's still ramping up, I feel. It's like. Connor's story is a very, uh, close to standard video game story, if you know what I mean. Like, he is... If this game was only had one main character, he would be that protagonist. Dummy. Dummy. Stupid. Dummy. That was so extra. I didn't need to make that jump. I could have gone around. The security here really sucks. This was super easy. Cyberlife warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. Leave it to me. What if the drone's sentient? You just kill it? Reconstruct. Would be too high. Would be spotted. Is there anywhere is there any other direction I can look? Oh, there's one. No. This one. There. Climb up. Would be too high. Okay. Uh, not that then. There we go. There's probably more steps. Okay, let's go. Keep it pushing, keep it pushing. Got his ass. Got his ass. You okay? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Good job, Marcus. Yeah, I'm pretty cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sick. Quick, open the other crates and fill your bags. Take as much as you can. They just leave this shit out here? It's not even in the actual... It's not even in the actual warehouse. Guys, move. Move. 
me when I grab blood and also legs. You were trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level two infraction. I will notify security. John! God damn machine! Where is it this time? Grab and hide. John! I need your help. John! The drone, now this. Just my luck. You good, homie? You you okay, fella? Let's finish up and get out of here. What's it? So try to find some blue blood. Is, is the is the is the security guard dude just chilling now? Like he's like, I'm gonna just stand here. I'm I won't I won't I won't uh. I won't call security anymore. Did we like successfully deprogram or what? Check the bigger crate. Oh, that crate's bigger, all right. There's probably just like straight up robots in here. Connor! Wait, is that Connor? Yeah, those are Connors. Am I right? Why aren't you like us? Don't you want to be free? Free them? What? Free them? Freeing them is a risk. Because if they if they aren't like us, that's not Connor. Are you blind? Dude, they're white dudes with brown, with brown hair in a 3D video game. They all look the fucking same, dude. Free them, free, close. Free them, free them. Don't free them. They might be evil. That's my, that's the risk. You have to, you have to pick and choose. Because you can't trust everybody who's like, like you, because they might be snitches. Like, some of y'all don't know this, but on the Underground Railroad, and I'm only bringing this up because this game is definitely trying to be an allegory for that, but, like, she killed freed slaves that she thought might snitch because she couldn't risk them snitching. I'm sorry, but I gotta protect my own. That's all we can carry. Let's go. Take me with you. He's on their side. We can't trust him. He took a risk for us. We can't just leave him here. We can't bring him back. It's too dangerous. I'll bring this fella. He comes with us. I know where you can find more spare parts. What do you mean? The trucks. They're full of bio components. They run on autopilot, but they can be driven manually with a key. Where is this key? Down there, in the control station. There are two human guards. Black you bring him, but leave them? We have, I had no idea what alignment they, they had. Letting them go is a risk. This dude already fucking let us go and like asked to come with us before all this shit. Keep they were not evil though? Oh my god, you do you want me to have fucking precognition, dude? It's a fucking video game. I can't know all the answers. I'm just making the best choices I can. Let me let me live. Suicide markers. This guy didn't full. snitch, he was the safer bet. This is a truck full of spare parts. There'd be enough for all of us. We can't pass this up. And if we get killed, our people will have nothing. We can't take that chance. It's too risky. We gotta go big or go home. Wait here. If I'm not back in 10 minutes, go without me. Marcus. I'm coming with you. No, I'm going alone. 
It's not worth it for both of us to risk losing our lives. Give them your backpack at least, dog. Someone can wear it on the front. This looks like a McDonald's drive through straight up. Doggy. Is there like alcohol edibles? I hate the taste of this shit. Yeah, but it's still gonna taste like alcohol. Alcohol doesn't, um... Find the key. Goddamn dogs. What the fuck are they barking at? Why is he not going in the, in the direction I'm pressing they the keys like of? Storms. Yeah. I was gonna take my kids camping this weekend. So much for that. Is Mike still in zone four? Looks like it. And he should be done already. Better off in here than out patrolling in that. Fuck. Don't move, asshole! Holy shit! Hit the alarm! Fuck. No, I'm going back. Fuck that. That was so stupid. Can you even go back, or am I, like, cringing? Go back? I don't even know how. What are you even doing? I was trying to go around, because neither of them were fucking looking, but then the game decides that, No, you went beyond this point. That's arbitrary. You went beyond this arbitrary point. This game, like, is not fucking great at, like, community, like, letting you know what about information you need to do shit. I thought you weren't going to go back. Ugh, yeah, fine, you're right. I won't. We need to move. We have to get to that fence. Now you go back to previous choice or not? Or not. This infraction is being reported to the police. Stay where you are. By the way, I can absolutely break my own rule because it's my fucking stream and I can do whatever the hell I want. <laughs> if I feel like it, if I feel significantly miffed by a decision, I will go back. But this isn't that. Plus, last time it didn't fucking matter because, like, we got over it anyways. Sorry, dog. It's too late. If we go back, we'll be killed too. Sorry, fella. Thanks for the raid, Elm Tree. Appreciate it. We have blue blood and bio components. There will be enough for everyone. We couldn't have done it without Marcus. Go I back, the game was being stupid. I know, but the game's been stupid on a lot of counts, and that one wasn't specifically bullshit enough for me to uh, want to go back. I, it, it, like, it will have to be some fuck shit to like, make me break the rule, but I'm not saying I won't break it. It's just how I'm yes. trying to do this first playthrough. Here. But also, like, don't whine about it. Like, you're really annoying if you fucking... It's a stream, dude. Relax. It's my stream, so I have to stress over it. It's okay when I'm loud and abrasive and mean, but you guys have to behave yourself at all times. If you slip out of line once, then I'm gonna cry. Androids are free. You have to be perfect at all times. I'm allowed to be a human. Free to live in the dark, hoping that no one finds us. Free to die in silence. If you go back, it'll make you redo the entire chapter. Oh, fuck that. I'm not doing that. Waiting for a change. It's never going to come. But I don't want that freedom. And I'm not going to beg for the right to smile. Or love or stand tall. I don't know about you, but there's something inside me that knows that I am more than what they say. I am alive, and they're not going to take that from me anymore. Our days of slavery are over. What humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we take. We are people. We are alive. We are free. Yeah!
I am alive. I am here. I exist. Group returned with full bags. Fuck, we could have had the truck though. We could have had the truck though. Or or died right here. That's a that was a possibility. Fail to avoid guards, alarm sounds, run defense. Marcus got spotted. Find key. Okay, so if I'd skipped here, it would have just gone all the way to either this ending or this ending. Dog mauls John. Unfortunate. Yeah, if I, I'm, I'm assuming that like we would have lost a bag but gotten John if we went this way. All right, uh, one second, fellas. I'm going to run another ad break because I got to pee and also refill my uh, weed water. One wasn't enough. I need to make the mistake every person taking edibles for the first time does. Okay, okay, let's do this, okay. Back to business. All right, fuck, I gotta turn off the blue light filter. It is making the game uh, visually wrong. I wish I had weed right now, I haven't had it in like months. Hey, I mean, it's good to know that you can go with mon like months without it and be fine. And also, it's gonna hit like a freight train when the next time you do it. The sexiest androids? God, that wish that were me. Who wipes while standing? So, by choice, I wipe when I sit, but Smoke, like whenever she's in the bathroom, like she paws at the toilet roll, so I have to put the toilet roll inside the cabinet. So I have to open the cab- I have to get up to open the cabinet whenever I'm done shitting. It, it's, it's annoying, but it's the only reason I do it standing. I'd be sitting if I was, uh, given the option. What in the fuck? Oh, feels like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. Are you sure this is the place? Pretty sure. It's the address in the report. If you stand and wipe, doesn't your ass cheeks close? I mean, not any more than if you're repositioned on the toilet. Like, like, plus, listen, dude, you think I don't know how to dig between my ass cheeks? Come on now. I'm an educated man. I went to college. Let's get going. I learned it, I learned how to do it though, all right? Jesus. If you flip the roll the wrong way, the cat won't be able to roll it out. I tried both ways. She she figured it out. Also, that would just be like fucking bad for me. It's not even worth it at that point. I have to like deal with the like the toilet paper roll being all fucking like odd. Hank friend software instability i regret the poll yeah you didn't think there was a way i could ruin it for you but i will always Sexiest find one androids in town now i know why you insisted on coming here <laughs> uh oh boy wow this is so exploitative welcome to You deserve to be free. Connor! The fuck are you doing? <laughs> coming, Lieutenant. <laughs> I'm coming, all right, buddy. Hey, fella. I'll get you out of there someday. You're not gonna take my license, are you? I have nothing to do with this. They just leave the androids to keep dancing when, like, <laughs> when there's an ongoing police investigation? Ongoing, sir. I can't tell you anything for the moment. Hey, Hank. Hey, Ben. How's it going? It's that room there. Oh, uh, by the way, Gavin's in there, too. Oh, great. 
Dead body and an asshole, just what I needed. Hmm. This guy does not know how to use that stripper pole. He he is on that platform by complete chance. He does not work here. Like she knows how to work the pole. This dude has no idea how he got here. Lieutenant Anderson and his plastic pet. The fuck are you two doing here? We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh yeah? Only wasting time. There's some pervert who uh <laughs> got more action than he could handle. What, you think you got <laughs> fucked to death? We'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. It's uh I'm starting to stink of booze in here. I should shoot him. Night, Lieutenant. Okay, Hellboy, let's do this. Were they fucking with the clothes on or something? Analyze. Oh, hey! Oh, Connor, you're so disgusting. If, I think I'm gonna puke again. If it works, it works, buddy. Serial number... They, they had serial numbers on the blood? That's crazy. Critically damaged. Yeah, she's screwed. She is dead, dead. That's his wife. That's the actor who plays Connor's IRL wife. Wait, so the actress in this dead body is the person who plays Connor's <laughs> real wife? Jeez, that, was, that must have been a fun day on the mocap set. Yeah, you stay away from those. You stay away from those. You've had enough. You've had enough, mister. But I have not. Give me that. Driver's license says... Michael Graham. Credit card. Cash in the wallet. Deceased. Time of death. Certified by individuals department. Is he... Has he got a criminal record or anything? Severe abusing, signs of strangulation, cause of death asphyxiation. Oh, he was... Did it as a fetish thing and she's like, nah, I'm killing this dude. But she's also dead. How did that happen? Thanks for the uh, sub, Fushigi to Morbid. What else? There it is. Cardiac arrest. Heart attack, not cause of death, no sign of cardiac event. Okay, so some shit happened to him. Victim was strangled. Picture of his wife and two daughters. He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been rough play. Thanks for the sub, Lord Moki. Uh, that's Nobody very rough play, dog. Think you can read the android's memory? Maybe you can see what happened. Is that, like, invasive? I can try. Well. Time to have sex from the woman's point of view. This will be a new one. This is just like Black Ops 3. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. Yeah, it's PO3, right? She was pregnant with a robot baby. Everything's all right. All we want is to know what happened. Is 
Pete. Is he dead? Tell me what happened. He started hitting me. Again. Is the sub zombie bear? Did you kill him? No. No, it wasn't me. Who killed that man if it wasn't you? I don't know. I wasn't shut down. I... I didn't see anything. Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted to play with two girls. That's what he said. There was two of us. What model was the other android? Did it look like you? Damn it. They also fucking shaved time off the clock artificially. I had an hour. I had a minute and a half still. So there was another android. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. If it wasn't even if an android. you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place. Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh, shit. There's got to be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness. Somebody who saw it leave in the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Calm down, and then screams at her. Wow, talk about fucking profiling. Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk very much, you know? They come in, do their business, and then go on their way. I, I listen. The the dudes look good, but I feel like morally uh, bankrupt looking at them in any sort of like ogling way. This feels this is so icky. So icky, dog. Not a fan. Just vanished. Never found out what happened. No fingerprint detected. Please try again. Probably don't have any CCTV. No way. Can I rip off the dude's hand? Appreciate about Eden Club. Discretion. They can come and go without a trace. Wait, stop looking at girls? Sure. That yeah, business is booming, right? Yeah. Can't complain. <laughs> the thing about androids is they're up for whatever you want. You won't get any diseases and uh, they won't tell anyone. Bruh. So why not go wild? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the more I learn about people, the more I love my dog. Sumo! Come here. <laughs> come here, buddy. Excuse me, Lieutenant. Can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. I can't open this shit because my fingers are jelly. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor. We got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. You can, I could tell him what I'm thinking. Couldn't we just ask the manager, hey, open this unit for the investigation? This is not going to look good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. Eden Club wishes you a pleasant experience. You're welcome. Delighted to meet you. No, you ain't. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? That much just for 30 minutes? Listen, it's it, it as fucked as it is. It is it is a very like niche commodity. What did we tell you about looking at girls? Oh yeah, because looking at the dudes oh, is any more morally off. okay. What the hell are you doing? I'm brainjacking this bitch. A blue-haired Tracy headed towards the entrance. And then I got rented. Ah, uh, look at look at this fucking chud. <laughs> the economy in this game is in shambles, dude. Their, their American dollar is worth more than the real world one right now. It saw something. What are you talking about? Saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue-haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. 
Who could see? I think, um... She has the best angle of the entrance. Hey. Hey, what am I supposed to do with this one? Tell you... Let's try this one. Fuck it if you want, I don't know. Fuck, this is not a good angle at all. It turned back into the club. It saw the blue-haired Tracy. I know which way it went. Think. Okay, she was right there. Go for it! There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know which direction it took. I just need to find another android on its path. Come on, fella. Sorry about the money, dog. Turn to it turned to the red room. Am I allowed to walk through this red force field? Nice. That dude over there has the best angle of the whole room. Me and Bethesda character creator. Hey, big guy. They, like, an incredibly big guy. Fucking move. No. I lost its track again. Spent all this money and I'm... I'm still not having fun. Okay. Still not having fun. Get the fuck out of the way! Get the fuck out of the way! It didn't see me. How much time? Anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This is gonna be the most expensive investigation of my career. Really? Good lord, man. I'm gonna have to check every single one of the fucking building. Nothing. What are these fellas? Blue-haired Tracy didn't come this way. Holy shit, dude. This is impossible. No. I lost its track again. Spent all this money and I'm still not... There she is. I'm gonna take a risk on this one. Red room, blue room, two room, three room. D come on, where's the fucking button prompt? Dude! You didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive investigation of my career. Could you- would it kill these people to look in a usable direction? Oh my fucking god, this artificial difficulty is so stupid! Nothing. Who heard Tracy didn't come this way. It's like, guess correct, dude, holy shit! It hid in a room. Cool.
Janitor. Oh, he's in he's interactable. Dude, that was literally her. That was literally her. I know where it went. Follow me. Oh, fucking A. This is crazy. Wait. I'll take it from here. I really think I should lead the way, considering that you're like drunk as hell. Like you're off your rocker dog. You couldn't drive. You shouldn't be holding a firearm. Blue haired deep. Shit. We're too late. I mean, I got it at the last moment, thankfully. Doesn't help that it's like, no sprinting, no running allowed, you have to walk at walking speed! Whatever. Christ, look at him. Get used till they break and then they get tossed out. Yep. RA9. The RA, the whole RA9 thing is just like a disease where every robot with agency has to leave a clue. Founder. That's that's her. Nine fifty four four five four three seven. Blue blood trail. <laughs> Who the fuck mentioned Zell? Who the fuck mentioned Zell for what? Is he here or some shit? People are fucking insane. They don't want relationships anymore. Everybody just gets an android. Do you think I'm the person to vent Cook to about what that? you want. They screw when you want. You don't have to worry about how they feel. Next thing you know, we're gonna be extinct because everybody would rather buy a piece of plastic than to love another human being. Beats me. Buddy, why are you... <laughs> he thinks of me as a person, at least. I got bored, so I said Zelinki. I mean, fair, it's just somebody I know had a nowhere getting mentioned, so pretty funny. It, it wasn't on this side, right? Unless I'm like missing an angle, like you could have gone up or some shit. Nope, this is where the trail ends, so it's gotta be inside, huh? Search warehouse? It, 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 which which objective is it, game, huh? Look in the corner. Oh, you can walk here. Oh, they're all in this together. <laughs> Beating up women simulator, apparently. Every game turns into it eventually. Dude, I literally clicked- I literally pressed the fucking button. Okay, 
listen, this thing is like apparently a sex bot, and I'm the top of the line most powerful robot Cyberlife has made. And it's given me a run for my ship. Oh, they're dating. Quick, they're getting away! It's, it's so fucking weird with keyboard prompts because they're not color-coded like they are on the PlayStation. When that man broke the other Tracy, I knew I was next. I was so scared. I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. And so I put my hands around his throat, and I squeezed until he stopped moving. I didn't mean to kill him. I just wanted to stay alive, get back to the one I love. I wanted her to hold me in her arms again. Make me forget about the humans, their smell of sweat, and their dirty words. Come on, let's go. Them fucking things is alive. They're alive, dog. It's probably better this way. Shout out, Hank. Old guy who does not hate gay people. You take it where you can. Small wins, people. Small wins. Deviants escaped. I could have killed her. But I uh, that wouldn't be as neat. That, like, fucking... Dude, the... the implications of this universe of these being living beings just dedicated to like having sex like with whoever it like pays the dollar with no choice that's so fucked up that's so fucked up what did david cage brain david cage brain man wait sorry Hank is a millennial. I think about that sometimes. You know what? Yeah, he would be, wouldn't he? Autonomous. With a Tesla. Car destination. It's a good thing Zlatko had a car. I wouldn't want Alice out walking in this cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zako even ever used it. It's a nice, nice little whip he's got here. These people we're going to see. How do you know about them? Overheard androids Zako captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. What if it was a lie? Or just another trap? All I know is those androids believed it. Until Zako killed them. Yeah, you know, pretty good, re pretty good reason to believe him, yeah? I've never seen snow before. It's pretty. Pretending I'm in a music video right out. now. But at least we won't meet any humans along the way. This game takes place in the future, so couldn't he be Gen Z? It, like, if he was on the oldest end of Gen Z, he'd be like 40 right now. Um, and because this takes place in 2038, apparently. Um, and he looks closer to 50, like mid-50. Malfunction detected. 
Emergency brakes activated. God damn it. He's canonically born in 1998. This doesn't look good. Oh. What happened, man? Stay inside, Alice. Probably close this door. Let the chill. Don't let the chill out. Okay, cool. I was gonna say. I was gonna suggest that he get that thing out of his head. The little ring beeper thing. What are we going to do? I don't know. Continue on foot, I guess. It's thirty degrees. Alice won't make it. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. The car? They know where we can stay around here, Carol. Oh, I thought that was a cutscene. I wasn't walking. Find shelter. Rock. I'm gonna get hit by a car, ain't I? He was born in 1985. Detroit becomes Spewman. Oh, hey, look, a convenient arrow t pointing towards hopefully shelter. A f it's a fucking amusement park. Awesome. He's all bundled up and getting ca- That's so cute. That's so cute. Why not just stay in the car? What? That's what I was saying, man. You're more likely to be found by people if you're on the side of the road. They're not going to know you're an android we just to by looking shelter. at you. We have to get out of the cold. The, the, the seats were turning around in the car, which means the electricity still worked. Like, the battery was still on. Maybe it was because it was smoking they were afraid it would blow up. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while. Anything? No. Damn structure. Unsafe. No place we could spend the night. I don't understand what the fuck is going on. Yeah, you kind of had to be here for yesterday's stream. Too windy for Alice. What if we like pried apart some stuff and made a house? Smoking cars are usually not a good idea to be in here unless you are. Beware! Oh, it's an android. Danger always comes when least expected. Dude, that's right. They would just use androids for all of these like animatronic needs, cause. Oh, that that's a dead android over there, cause it's been frozen in place. He died like this. Staring into nothing. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. He's on Cam 5. He's on Cam 5. Kara is so stupid, I would never turn on androids or anything alone. No, that was me who turned it on. I had the option to not. And I chose to because I wanted to see what would happen. Plus, I've got this big brolic dude behind me. I think he would be of some help. You are here. Um, okay, so if we go out to the left, Ferris wheel. What's our best bet? Probably, uh, the tropics or the castle, maybe. I'm thinking probably the castle, so up, right, left.
try the tavern? This place is falling apart. It's not gonna be easy to find shelter. Found a house. Most wood. Oh, there's a big hole in the roof. That's not gonna be very sturdy. Looks safe inside. I'll handle this. Where did you put the kid? Oh, found him. Here we go. Thank you, fella. God bless you. This thing's still working? USS Iowa missing. This cannot be a recent article, man. Canada, where the arm is clean and welcome is always warm. Discover the landscape. Wild of Canada. Story class submarine disappeared in polar waters. President Warden's secret is has made no secret that she thinks the Russians did it. Kremlin has yet to release a statement beyond a denial, though Russia not one of the U.S. has no business being in the Arctic anyway. Seems sus. Gossips Weekly. Fans scream traditionalist weep all android band tripped for music prize. I'll make the fire here. That way we won't be smoked out. Damn tipped. Yeah, I don't care. She? You go, I guess. Check Luther's bag, make a bed for Alice. Who else thinks Luther is hot? Anybody with sense? Arr, this'll be super comfy for ya. For ya. Come here, child. Alice? Thanks for the 200 bits, Slaytron Mac. Optimist, uh, sincere? I don't know how to be like that, Alice. I've never been a part of a family. But maybe we can be our own family. Be happy in our own way. As long as we're together, that's all that matters. Yay, she trusts me. God, I'm such a good mother in video Stay games. Quite Twitch chat not be down bad challenge impossible. I mean, yeah, my entire audience is like kind of based off that, you know. Check gun. I always check on my firearms, you know, gun safety. Cookie. There are some cookies left. Would you like some? No, I'm not hungry. Well, I tried. Where are the firearms at? Tuck Alice in after I get my booze. Yeah, that was the funny article. Mm -hmm. 
How is she not hungry? When was the last time she ate? I feel like it's a pretty safe bet that they robbed Zlatko, Zlatko's place before they left, right? Like, if it's if you're gonna go out on a big trip, you probably rate it for supplies. Considering they only need to feed one of them, they only have to take so much. Do you stream with your mask on or off? I bet you look at the screen. You'd be able to tell that I... I it's very clearly right there. Oh. 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 Those cookies are probably old as hell. They're no, they, no, no, no. This is the bag we brought with us. All right. Get cozy, buddy. Three kiss tomorrow. Sleep tight, Alice. Sweet dreams. Thanks for the hundred bits. Push for push for more. Can you tell me a story, Kara? I have nine thousand children's stories in memory. I should have one for you. Princess Unicorn Knight. Let's go, Princess. This is a story about a princess who. No, not a story like that. Make one up for me. <laughs> Be creative, this loser. Is a story about a little girl. Fear. Who lived alone in a big old house. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but she was different. And that made her very sad. Then she met a robot. You didn't make that up. We just did that shit. Who was just as lost as the little girl. So they decided to run away together. Better life. To try to find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but... Together. Together. But they stuck together, so they overcame all of them. Along the way, they met... A giant. A giant. Another robot. I... Who left his master to become their guardian. How does the story end? Realistic? Moral? I don't know. But all stories have morals. When we reach the end of ours, we'll know what it really meant. Time to sleep. We have another long day ahead of us tomorrow. It was so obviously about us, I was like, I shouldn't even try and you dress it up as anything else. Say good night, loser. Yes. Yes, of course. Shit story, tell another one. Alice. Sleep tight. My heartstrings. Me heartstrings, fellas. They are being tugged. Being played like a fiddle. thought about it. I've never been free before. Free? <laughs> I like the sound of it. But I don't know what it really means yet. Do you remember anything from your life before Zlatko? 
No. My model was designed to carry heavy loads. I might have been a longshoreman or a laborer. Who I was doesn't matter anymore. It wasn't really me. Kara, have you ever noticed anything about Alice? No. What do you mean? Oh, shit. Kara! You gotta board up the windows! Ten points each! Woo! It's, it's cod zombies! Woo! Gotta protect Alice. Firearm, let's go! Go away! Go away, you hear me? Don't be afraid. We don't want to hurt you. We're just like you. Our name is Jerry. Our name? We were working here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. She looks sad. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in it. Well, she should follow us then. Alice, I don't know if it's yeah, good. No, no, right? dumbass kid, dumbass kid. I don't think you have any choice. Dumbass kid, dumbass kid. This is the, this is the part about raising children that sucks. They're stupid and idiots. And not at all smart. Why was putting out the fire an option, by the way? Like, what would that have done in that situation? Bro, you need to go to bed. Be our guest. Be our guest, be our guest. We are Jerry. Mandarin. We got President Warren into office. The little one can climb on board. The carousel is- Sorry, chapstick. Sorry. Got some crusty ass lift right now. I found- I found one that doesn't, like, make my itch- my lips itch. And the coconut oil wasn't really helping with, like, that much. It's about to begin! When I see my dermatologist, you gotta ask him about it. Pushing child away from you, quick time event. It blows up and we die. Smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately. Bro, why does this look like it's still from the early 2000s? The game or the ride? Because if you're talking about the game, you're blind. Like, un unironically, if you think that, you... No eyes. Hey, shout out my boy, Jerry. And then they all lived happily ever after when they got into Canada and nobody died or got hurt. That was awesome how everybody uh, lived happily ever after and no one died and got hurt. The group enjoyed a quiet moment together. Alright, guys, I gotta take another pee break. I'll be right back. Don't worry, stream's still going.
Hello? Hello, hello? Hello? Hello, hello? Back to it. Um... Actually, you know, I think that's that's probably a good, um... I think, I think that's probably a good place to call it. Uh... Because we are, it is getting pretty late. It was an extra stream. I don't want to burn myself out for next week. I'll probably do some... I, may, I might do some tomorrow. We'll see. I feel like this is a game that at this point I should be uh, kind of pacing out. Jerry number 10 is my favorite. Good stopping point, genuinely. Yeah, it, like I don't want to overdo it because I, I feel like I could go longer. But if I, I've been overextending myself these last few days, and it's probably a little smarter to not... Anyways, I promised Jacqueline that she would get the raid if she was live. Which she is. All right. Fellas, Jacqueline is uh, one of my mods. They are currently streaming. Um, <laughs> Pop Tropica. You guys. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, lock in, lock in, lock in. We're going we're gonna to pop in there for the night. This is, everybody gets one, Jacqueline. Don't expect me to ever be nice to you in this way again. Oh my god, no! Lock in, lock in, we're gonna, we're gonna. Okay, let's go. This is, everybody gets one. I'm having heart palpitations. Oh no! You guys, I'm having heart palpitations. Oh my god, hello! Oh my god! Hi! Oh god, you can hear me on my own stream. I didn't get off of quite stream. Oh god. Dude, no way. Um, no way. hi everybody! 